Welcome back, everybody. So we're going to be taking a look at some of these uh, images from Japan with these Pikachu outbreak. So we can pretty much almost expect new raids coming soon. And I'll have these images playing out throughout the whole video, okay? We're going to be using TMs. Um, we're going to take a look at my legendaries and uh, all kinds of other random little things here. Okay, guys? So uh, stay tuned and I uh, hope you enjoy these images and uh, what I have to say. Some TMs and talking about a gym glitch which is unfavoriting your Pokemon. So we'll go ahead and start with that gym glitch one here. <laughs> so beware of this guys, um, let me show you. So what's going on is if you drop a Pokemon in a, in a gym and uh, when it returns to you it becomes unstarred. So for instance you guys know that my Reptar is starred. Well it was in a gym and now it came back and it's unfavorited. So you, be aware of that to not you know pay attention when you're transferring your Pokemon basically all right so Tetsuya I mean come on <laughs> I mean what, is, what what is this kind of bug you know what I mean so just go back and refavorite them I mean my blissies look at that no star okay so just go back let's just keep going down to see what we have here and take a look at this Lugia Z <laughs> Zapdos and um, Moltres all lined up there. Uh, I did power up my 84% uh, Articuno with 15 in attack and 12 in the rest, which is good to me. Um, it's only 100 off from the max, basically, CP. But it almost would have lined up with uh, all three of them. Wouldn't that have been nice? So let's see what else um, is unstarred here. Uh... Uh, there's probably a few, but we, we won't worry about that. So let's go ahead and... Alright, so yeah, be aware of that, guys. If you drop Pokemon in gym, they're going to be unfavorited until they fix it. It's obviously not going to last forever, um, hopefully. So let's go ahead and take a look at... You know what? Let's just go by number because it's easier that way. We can just look at all of them at the same time. I'm going to take a look at my legendaries now up to date. Okay, all right, starting with Articuno. So, I put all percentages on them, so that should be interesting for you guys to see. The only one I've powered up uh, is the this one and this one. So don't think that 1726 is actually what I caught it at. Definitely not. So, there you have it. Uh, this is probably my best one here. Let's take a look at what the stats are. Simply amazing. HP. All right, so it's got a hundred or fifteen in HP. Okay, sweet. Let's see what my lowest one is. Seventy-three. Mm. Let's take a look at that. Strong. HP. Okay, still keeping it for people who don't have them when trade comes out. All right, so take a look. Well, first let's go to the top. All right, so my maxed out zap dose. Zap dose. My goodness. Um is a 91% 15 in attack and 13 in the rest so not bad yeah max attack basically all I want that's all you really need to be honest um, this is the 91 pretty good all right nothing max but still good all right, have a couple 91s in 86, 84, 80, 77, getting low, 77 and again. Um, not sure what's up with this. All right, I'll put percentage on that later. 77 and then, a oh, wow, a steepingly low 68. That's quite the uh, low percentage to catch for a legendary raid. Um, let's take a look here. <laughs> Strong. Could you imagine getting something that's uh, not very good? Th I mean, this is not very good, but... <laughs> Technically, at the end of the day, powering it up, and if they went head-to-head, -head, this one versus the maxed out one, if this one was maxed out as well, that would be an interesting thing to compare. See what... How much IVs really make a difference? Y you could just simply attack a, like a raid boss and determine 
things like that, but I can't wait for PvP. <laughs> oh my goodness, that was the most uh, anticipated thing I wanted for the, out of this game, and it's still um, not here, but that's alright. They gotta perfect it before they release it. This one's a 98. Oh, right, go Valor. Let's take a look. HP, defense, wow. Okay, so it's got 15 everything except for... Um, Oh. Nah. Of, of course except for attack uh, it's alright but it's a 98 it's looking good um, and then we go 95 which wow that's really nice nah that one's got a max attack okay so 88, 88, 88, 84 80, 82, 80 82, 82 80 Okay, so, let's go take a look at Lugia. I know you guys have seen these already. Alright, Theris, <laughs> 84%. I mean, woof. I just wanted to max one out. Alright, so we're looking great here with this 98 silver. Oh, yeah, that's, that's real nice. Then a 95. Very good. Followed by a 93, 82, 77, 82, 82, 80, 75, and 75. Yeah, I'm, I'm extremely content. I really am. Okay, so... Wow, look at that. Fortress and its evolution. Very nice. Would that be something if it just popped up? Okay, so now let's go ahead and use some TMs. Um, let's go ahead and do charge first. I don't... I don't really know who I'm going to change yet, but we can just take a look to see. Oh, you know what I want to change? Um, hmm. One of these right shoes, yeah. For sure. That's a 96. Okay. Let's see. What does he have? Thunder Punch? Let's, let's forget that. Quick break? Nope. Gotta go again. Okay. I'm done there. Moving on to the next. That was wow. Woo! <laughs> Not a great start. Alright, so let's see what else we can change the moves of. Ooh -wee. Uh, mm, everything looks good here. Gotta transfer those Zubats. Mr. Biggs looking good. There was a 100% I was pretty sure I wanted to change the move set of. Okay. Um, so. That event over in Japan, wow! Have you seen footage of that? It looks so awesome. They have Wobbuffet raids, they have Dragonite raids, um, Houndoom Houndo raids, and uh, Ursaring raids. I don't know what else they're gonna have, like if they're having gonna drop some more. I'm thinking maybe they're gonna bring out Ho-Oh and uh, <laughs> bring it out there first. Could you imagine? Oh my goodness, they're so lucky to be over there. All right, so, but the thing is like spoofers, <laughs> they can just teleport there. But oh well, maybe we'll get something like that for ourselves in the future, hopefully, uh, everywhere, because that's super cool. The spawn rates from Reap and all the rare things, Lavatar, they're all over. It's not like, it's not even rare. It's just bleh, everything. All right, so let's continue to move on here. Let's see what else I can find. Um, hmm. Man, I had so many things. I was thinking about Maggie. Still thinking about it, but I don't know. I'd be taking a risk. Because that first set just now, that was pretty bad. Maybe we can change a few legendary sets. The high ones. Um, Not Articuno. Zap. Zap Cannon. Yeah, let's go ahead and try to get uh, Thunderbolt. There we go. Very nice. Okay. Uh, we have another 91 here. Thunderbolt. No, keep that. I think that one's going to be a really nice one. Um, Hammer Cop. I, I, maybe I might want to change that. But first I want to go test them out at the gym battles before I even do that. And then we'll see how it performs. I already know it's going to be nice. Uh, but after we have video of it, then we'll go ahead and switch it up and get Thunderbolt and test that one out as well all right so this 95 moltres has overheat yeah i changed all these already fire blast 88 okay 
We'll keep them like that. That's pretty nice. Um, all my Dragonites are looking good. This one is Hyper Beam. I think I want to go for Outrage. So we're going to go ahead and try that. This is a 100% right here, by the way. Hurricane. Oh, wrong Dragonite. Let's try again. Go for Outrage. There we go. Beautiful. Thank goodness. Man, when it bounces back, back and forth between two moves when there's three, you know, that's the worst. Whew. Okay, okay, I got Petal Blizzard on that one. Okay, very good, very good. Um, let's see here. Oh, okay, 100% uh, Crobat has Shadow Ball. Not bad, um, because it's going to be super effective against the Pokemon that are super effective against it. For instance, Psychic. But it's 100, and I kind of want to change it to Sludge Bomb. There we go. Bingo. Thank you. All right, and let's see what else we can do here. Maui Kaui, you, hoo -hoo, I'm not even going to try. We'll go ahead and just pass those. Pseudo Wudo, there's one in here that I need to change. I believe it's the 1305. I want to change its quick attack. And we'll go through here and use the quick moves too as well. Um, I think that about almost wraps it up for these charge moves let's see the scissors nah we'll keep those you actually you know what what does it have night slash okay so all right i'm thinking this is what i'm thinking because when mewtwo comes out scissors is going to be great okay but this one over here has iron head so it's just going to be neutral damage but if I switch it to uh, X Scissor, I'm thinking either I switch one of these and power it up. But on the other hand, I think the smart move would be to wait until Mewtwo comes out and it's all, you know, all there. And I'm not saying it's <laughs> coming out or anything soon. I'm just throwing this out there. So maybe I should just change its move when it hits and instead of powering another one up and just do that. Yeah, I think I'll stick with that, that set there. Um, bear hug. What does he got? No, hyper beam. Keep that for sure. And all of those are good. Everything looking good. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and use these charges really fast here. Let's see what we can find. Um. Wow, that right you just went back and forth. That was pretty silly there. All right, I'm going to go ahead and skim all the way down because I don't think there's anything up there. Then again, <laughs> who knows? I'm probably skipping a whole bunch of things that I want to switch. That always happens. I go back and then I'm just like, wait, I should have done that. Yeah, You know what I was thinking? Hmm. No, we'll keep fire spin. I wanted to maybe get overheat because he still has fire blast. My Flareon, my 100%. So, but I, <laughs> at the same time, I can get flamethrower. So, I definitely don't want that. But I, I think I'm gonna give that a shot after I see what I can do here. Um, Optimum Dragon Tail. Though you want to keep that. That's yeah, keeper. And for alligators, looking good. Yes, everything. All right. All right, so this will go from Charge Beam to um, Volt Switch, which I'm not going to do. Volt Switch is a very nice move if you if it's a defending Pokemon. Otherwise, it's you know it's good and all. It does a lot of damage, but it, you can't dodge. You literally can't. <laughs> Maybe a few here and there, but depending on the Pokemon you're fighting, how fast it is or how slow. All right, so. Man, I don't even know if I want to change any of these, to be honest. Bullet Punch, oh no, keep. Keep it. Yeah, I think that's about does it. So, at least you were, oh, well, no, no. At least you were able to see all my Pokemon there, right? For the new uh, subscribers or new viewers. And the rare candies are at 591. I need to go out and do some raids. Got my free raid pass, still haven't used it today. Um and stack up that Stardust. Basically, that's what my mission is at this point. Um, 
So I think that's it guys. Thank you for watching and I will catch you on my next video. Take care.